Good morning, ladies. My name is Chaz, and welcome to the, uh, or welcome back to, what if Zuku was the multiverse speedster, like a flash. So, <clears throat> in part one, I went over the, like the main storyline thing, but now I'm just going over the. So. Where we left off, Zuku, who, like, woke up from the bad headache, he knows that he has Ochako with him, and Ochako asks him, Hey Zuku, how well did you sleep last night? I up and... And that will, because the, hey, are you going to go to a school thing? Yeah. So, she goes to, or she gets dressed for school, and, yeah. So, he's, he wants to spend time with his, like, Mother before he goes to school. So. He. Tells her. Zumi. Or no. Zuk, or Inko. No, sorry. So. Inko tells him. Or actually. How well did you sleep last night? Well. Okay. Not that great, but the least I had my eyes closed. But one thing that really terrifies me is all of the like souls, like the <clears throat> like your all of your spirits, like all of it, yeah. L looked at me, he. Yeah? And told me that I was a menace to society and every negative thing. As Umi, or as Inko, she knows that in her heart she. She wishes it, it wasn't true, but sadly it was. <laughs> the, he's been in there since. Or, 11 years. He been in the, the, that pocket universe thing or whatever that's called for 11 years yeah as as you mean or as Inko says yeah you just need to relax okay you, I know that you oh been through that at too many times. Yeah. I'll take Zumi and Ochako to school, okay? So he does. It's as he picks both Zumi and Ochako up. As he uses the speed, as he moves fast, <laughs> as Jiro says, "Here comes Zuku." <laughs> yeah, because her foot uh, or his footsteps are just like that same sound. Sound um, of a, yeah. 
as as he drops both of them off and everyone all those girls saw him and they were amazed yeah as Bakugo says hey Zuko what's up as he gives him a high five and then when I'm still recuperating from that but okay so because Last night, I saw in my dream, or in the dream, of me being in that same area, but with all the, with all of your souls, like the, your spirits looked at me and said, like, I was a menace to society and all that stuff. All that negative stuff. Oh. Yep. Okay. Am I? As the entire Class 1A and Class 1B says at exact same time, no, you are not. You are the... Yeah. So, the da da da, sorry, Nenzu says that you you are her a pro hero, anyways, because actually Nenzu promoted him to being a pro hero because. He did not realize that they, like da da da. So, time skip to eighteen, or actually nineteen, or no twenty. So, or, or Chaco gets married to Zuku. And like the typical thing, and I do not ship the Bakugo with Ochako because it seems like a weird combination to me. And when I was making the part one of this video, of this video, the or part one, I he thought about like what if the back rooms was the um, what if back rooms were the multiverse and we're all inside of it. But right now we just like left the our or we went through the door to go into the back rooms no clipping is the door to the back rooms and that's what I think because the front rooms are like the real rooms So, yeah. So, yeah, the... And the backrooms entities are people in costumes. Like, that they were stuck in there forever. That's what I believe before but let's move on from yeah. so Ochako oh 
Ako is and Z Zuku had their first child. The first child had or they had six kids, but the first kid had the many powerful m modes in it. So yeah. He, that kid can go into the what Zuku was talking about and comes right back out. Second kid, same thing, but with gravity like fused into it and basically all those kids have like different powers but they all have they can get into the metaverse and jump right it back out at will. So, yeah. So, basically, Zuku is not so useless. But Zuku ends up he really wants to test out something and because he he did like touch the doomsday zukus so he basically transforms into spikes you see him like basically yeah and plus he's immortal mortal because he never ages, he can never die. But Ochako, on the other hand, yeah. As they could not believe. Yeah. As he watched all of his friends, his loved ones died. Except for him and his kids, of course, the, because their kids, or his kids, are mortal too. So. He watched his entire thing pass away. Yeah. It breaks my heart. And seeing people like Ochako, Dark Shadow, Momo, the Proud Girl. Bakugo, Todoroki, everyone un, un, was dead. Except for Zuku and his kids. So, yes. It's a sad, sad story. But Zuku, oh, and his kids lived their best lives. He was, he was, as, yeah. So they go to the and, uh, or actually they went, or the kids, like his kids, went to another metaverse. But Zuku used his own power to reset the timeline. So it basically got to all the way back to where we started in, like, part one and so, please leave a like, share, subscribe, comment. I'm not going to go over the part one. You must check it out. Please have it on replay, like playlist, and then you re-circle it. That's what it is. So, peace out, y'all. Bye.